Hello there Vault Hunters, Kato Genesis here, bringing you a guide to Borderlands 3, this time going over the legendary Red Suit Shield. I'll be going over where to find this shield, and what you can do with it in this no-nonsense guide. Let's get started. There are two locations in which you can get the Red Suit, one of which is after completing the main quest, Angels and Speed Demons, which takes place after your return to Pandora, starting from Roland's Rest in the Devil's Razor, in which you go to retrieve a large piece of tech for Tannis from her old lab, which is in Conrad's Hold. You complete Angels and Speed Demons after retrieving said tech, arriving back at Roland's Rest, and then speaking to Vaughn. But if it is your first playthrough, it does scale to your level based on when you complete the quest. As for the second location, that would be at the Tazendir ruins on Necro de Feo. On the east side of Tazendir ruins, there is a dead end with a target of opportunity called Celestro and Atomic, a trooper and a heavy. They both have a chance to drop a legendary pistol called Pestilence, while just Atomic, at least from what I discovered, is the only one of these two who will drop the shield for you. So that's a couple of places you can find the red suit, now let's go over what it can do for you. The Pangolin Manufactured Red Suit lends itself very well to those who like to dabble in radiation. Shout out to my fellow Wastelanders. And the red text reads, Warning, Containment Failure which goes on to say, does radiation damage per second to nearby enemies and grants immunity to radiation. So in other words, the red suit creates a radiation aura around your character, and simply being near enemies will irradiate them. Each of the other effects rolled on the shield seem to affect the ability to put out more radiation damage, or in my case this exceptional one I got, anointed for phase grasping a siren, and on break will knock back enemies. Regular rolls of the shield are good too, I was just incredibly lucky with my second drop. This will pair exceptionally well with the Pestilence Pistol, which again, both Celestro and Atomic can drop as well. But there are many other things that can be paired with this shield, so let me know what you figured out in the comments below. If you'd like to see a guide on the Pestilence, even though I described most of it to you, you can check it out here. A special thanks to my Patreon supporters and Wasteland Legend Sven, and thank you for watching. I'm Kato Genesis, and may you water the galaxy like you own it.